Welcome to Pro Wrestling History Daily Top 5. I'm your host, the eclectic gentleman, Stefan Watts, and join me as I count down the top five moments for this day in pro wrestling history. But before we get started, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get our wrestling history on. Number 5, 1996. Larry Rocky Hamilton passes away. Better known as the Missouri Mauler, he is one of the earliest professional wrestlers to appear on televised wrestling events. He feuded with many popular wrestlers of the era, including Jack Briscoe, Plowboy Stan Frazier, Tim Woods, Tarzan Taylor, and Fritz Von Erich during his 31-year career. He is the older brother of wrestler Jody Hamilton, who competed as the masked wrestler The Assassin, as well as the uncle of former WCW wrestling official Nick Patrick. Number 4. 1992. The Natural Disasters, Earthquake and Typhoon defeat Money Inc., Ted DiBiase, and IRS to win the WWF World Tag Team titles in Worcester, Massachusetts. Number 3. 1998. Bret Hart defeated Diamond Dallas Page for the vacant United States Championship. The title was vacated by Goldberg when he won the World Heavyweight title. Number 2. 1963. Vern Gagne defeats The Crusher in Minneapolis, Minnesota to win the AWA World Heavyweight title for a fourth time. Gagne also won the Omaha version of the world title, which Crusher held and won from Fritz von Erich five months earlier. Number 1. 1973. Jack Briscoe defeats Harley Race in Houston, Texas to win the NWA World Heavyweight title, ending Race's first reign after less than four months. It would be over three years before Race would be champion again. This is the first of two runs with the title for Jack Briscoe. And that's our list. Make sure to comment below what you feel was the number one moment for this day in pro wrestling history.